Okay, here's a common mistake most people make. Let me turn uh, my camera off. Actually, let me turn it back on. Is they've always uh, got their uh, lithium ion batteries topped off or if they're going to take a vacation. And uh, they'll constantly be uh, keeping them charged at 100%. Well, I mean, ultimately, does it really matter? I mean, uh, uh, the batteries for this are around like $45. If you buy the off-brand, they're certainly a lot cheaper. But, I mean, you don't want to necessarily have to uh, ditch out more money than necessary. Um, right now, uh, my uh, vertical grip battery is at 61%. The way lithium ions are most happy, to put it in really simplistic terms, they're happy floating back and forth between 30% and 75 or 80%. So if you're constantly topping off your batteries, like if you obviously have a shoot tomorrow or something like that, obviously you want to keep all your batteries charged and go out in a shoot. Nobody wants to go out in a shoot with 60% charge on uh, their batteries, obviously and logically so. But as so far as uh, your backup camera, and if you see it at like 40% or something, oh my, my backup uh, camera, the battery is 40%, you're constantly topping it off. Uh, lithium uh, batteries do not like that. They like to float between roughly 30% and 75 and 80%. Um, used to do tech support for Apple, and I did so much deep research uh, on uh, lithium batteries, it's unbelievable. I talked to some of the people that uh, were hardcore technicians on lithium batteries, and I actually developed the foolproof methodology on how to take care of lithium ion batteries for laptops. The same thing is true as applicable for your DSLR uh, lithium batteries. Uh, another thing that you should do, especially with a vertical grip, is that you're constantly charging your vertical grip battery, and yet uh, the battery in your DSLR is uh, slowly draining due to humidity and a typical leak dissipation you know upwards 90 percent like mine is right now or near 100 percent is that um, every shoot or two depending on how often you shoot go ahead and take off your vertical grip and swap out uh, your DSLR battery uh, with your uh, your uh, vertical grip battery and just a simple thing to remember I mean obviously these batteries are not really expensive like laptop batteries where it's a serious concern you're going to pay a technician to remove the remove the battery and these are not being used as gaming machines you can actually have really rapid uh, charge dissipation although you can if you're using the uh, built-in pop-up flash which I certainly hope you are not doing um, but you know the important point is is that don't always be uh, keeping your uh, batteries topped off unless you know you'll be going on a shoot tomorrow or if necessary keep a second set that are topped off and uh, if you have a huge pile of batteries which most shooters do you know, I've got 12 or 14 uh, of the, these batteries, the D750, D7100, and DA10. And, uh, you know, let them float somewhere about 50% or 40%, and that's where they're actually most happy and uh, will have the, long, the greatest longevity. So, not really a very important point, but it's something that most people don't consider. That, uh, they don't know that they're actually kind of sticking a knife in the back of their lithium-ion batteries by constantly always keeping them topped off unnecessarily key keyword being unnecessarily so <whistles> thanks for watching catch you later and uh, check out this next video and uh, go over a, a fail on uh, something and uh, it's the same fail that the apple made it's uh, rather quite uh, funny and uh, catch you later bye